Today we are going to strut our stuff. See what I did there, Gary. We are going to replace the bonnet struts. We're actually going to do another video in a minute for the tailgate struts as well. But these little short ones, we are going to replace these. So these hold your bonnet up. It's like my jumper today, Gary. Yeah, okay, yeah it's lovely. People say I look like a school teacher in my jumper, so I've been trying to find more school teachery jumpers. Right, here we go. So. So we've got two of these. Gary's good at these, so I'll get Gary to do these. So obviously you've got the struts here. Notice that you've got the body section at the top and the piston section at the bottom. Um, and they're on these little ball joints. We've got these little spring-loaded joints here, and you, they go into a little ball. And there's a little spring here. And what it does is, so if that's the ball, you've got the little spring, and as you push it over the ball joint, it goes and clips around it. But when you take them off, what Gary's going to do is there's a little slot there, and he's going to get a, he's going to get the screwdriver in there. Ooh, that's where I stabbed myself. And he's just going to lift it off a bit like that. And then you see the teeth aren't there, so then he can pull that off. Um, but for the new ones, we should just be able to snap them on, right? I got to put that back now. Haven't I? Let me slide that back down there. Look. Oh, I'm going to stab. There you go. So you can see there. You can see the little teeth. Right, and Gary, let's swap, let's swap roles here. Yeah. All right, have we got enough light in there to see what's happening? I'm going to just grab a torch to see if was a bit more light. Right, we're going to try and do this. We normally have me holding and filming, but Gary's got a bit of wood there, so jam that bit of wood in, because you guys will be... If you've got kids, get the kids to hold it up for you, or you'll be dropping it on your head, because as soon as you take these off... Right, and let's, let's dive in here, Gary. So let's have a look what we've got going on. Hold on, hold on. I've got, the, I've got to find out where the camera is. There we go. Right. I'm not good with this technology, Gary. Try and lift it off like that. Lift it off, yeah. So I'll separate it a little bit now. This way, right, right. Oh, I'm going to... Go on. Watch your head. All right, let's clip back in. All right, let's clip back in. <laughs> That's it. Right, and then the bottom one, you should just be able to sort of lever it off a bit. If you, it normally comes off, doesn't it? If you just... Is it fighting you, Gary? We're we going to have to unclip it. It comes off. So, but you can do the same technique with the little screwdriver if it's not coming off. Yeah. Right, now let's have a read, Gary. How many Newtons is... So the new one is, it's got... Let me see if I can get the camera to focus on it. Oh, it's getting... Let me touch the screen. Yeah. So it says there 400 and... 410 newtons you can see written there and let's have a look if the compare it against the new ones Gary check it's the same length first of all check they've check, check they haven't sold us a that's looking good isn't it the, yeah. and the ends look the same don't they yeah. and what's the pressure on the old one Gary is that the same 410 yeah right good so yeah so look at that just to check so there should be 410 newtons they should be the same length and then which so we got the pist uh that's right you got the well, I've got the cylinder at the top and the rod at the bottom. It doesn't matter which end you put them on. And there you go, that's that on. Right, now what we didn't show you at the beginning, our bonnet would, it wouldn't whoosh up, would it? It would, it would sort of stay, but we're hoping that when you lift the bonnet after we've put these new ones on, it's going to go whoosh. Now you've got that wire in the way a little bit there, making it a little bit trickier for you. Now, it might help if I wiggle the... Oh, you got it. There you go. Yeah. If I put the camera in the right place. Don't leave that screwdriver down there. No. Someone told you off for that last time you did that, Gary. Yeah. <laughs> ah, is it, is it... Do you need to lift the bonnet a no, bit? Oh, you got it. You got it. You just got to fish it out. Wiggle that one off. Sweet. Gary closed the bonnet on the screwdriver last time and someone said, oh, we thought we'd got away with it. We thought no one noticed. <laughs> right then, let's have a look. Take that out. Right, so to get it halfway, Gary, and see if it will zoop up now. See if it will push itself up. Or will it... That! It didn't do that before, did it? No. It would sort of stay, but not whoosh. So there we go. That is the bonnet struts upgraded or replaced on the Freelander 2. They're the same on all years on the Freelander 2. Um, good luck with that.